YouTube and my fellow McGregor sailors. Uh, today, I'm going to talk about a fix for all those people who haven't uh, fixed the outboard center problem on the transoms of these boats. We're going to fix it with this. I'll just take you a stone real quick and show you how I did that. Worked out pretty good. There's that hinge. Motor's now nice and centered on the transom. More or less. part is that you can finagle it to the exact centeredness that you wanted by using this little system here. I keep a couple of these on the boat, these little screw things that should be attached by a lanyard. So, you can see that I've cut the hinge off one end. I've cut this extra little hole off. So now it can swivel, which it really wanted it to do in the first place. This is a cast stainless hinge. It's available at West Marine for like $30 a set. You only need one, so if you have one of your McGregor friends, it's only going to cost you 15 bucks. Little scrap of starboard there. Uh, this seems like it's a pretty strong hinge. I mean, you know, probably not for ocean crossing, but there's really not a whole lot of stress on this when you put this in here. All it needs to do is hold the uh, outboard centered. And I always take this off when I sail because otherwise the uh, uh, motor bollocks us up the feeling of the boat, but when you're motoring, certainly it's nice to have it uh, centered when you're using the, the rudders, which I hardly ever use the rudders when I'm motoring. I usually just uh, have it connected to the steering, but on occasion I do motor sail, and uh, the fact that this outboard was slightly off-center always annoyed me. Because it just seemed like it was, I don't know, it was just annoying. So, yay, I finally fixed it. Hurrah! And, uh, you know, it's maybe even a little bit less slop than that little pin that he had on there. You know, Roger had on there. Uh, yeah. The nice thing about this is when it comes up, which I sail with it, Attached like this, off of the steering, but up. Well, before, sometimes the steering linkage used to get hung up on this. Because this was tilted over here, and this distance to this was less. Because this used to have to be over here. It's only about an inch or so. Uh, but now, that steering bar clears it very nicely. There's no hung up deadness on that. And even when you have the motor halfway down, because sometimes I do sail with the motor like that, just to give myself a little bit of extra stuff in the water, you know, just a little corner of that foot in the water. Um, and it's still, boom, bottoms out before it hits that joint, whereas before, you see that end of that steering bar, it used to hang up on that knuckle, right there, and 
and one time it even caused me to not be able to tack the boat uh, and I kind of had to scramble to figure out what the heck was going on with the steering before I got washed up on a little shoal. Uh, you know, nothing like dangerous or anything, but certainly it would have been a nuisance. So, uh, all I can say is again, because uh, I won't bore you with any more of this video, there it is, it's a cheap, easy fix. And I love cheap, easy fixes.